She's noontime Saturday. We don't usually film on Saturdays, but today we're filming on Saturdays. Because it's a good day to be alive. It's a good day. It's 10, sunny and 75 out today, actually. So beauty. So, so beauty. beauty. We are going to film today, and then I was like, you know what? Every day is a good day for filming. <laughs> <laughs> yep. So we're in Brantford. Brantford. Brantford on Terrible. Choo choo. We just picked up a couch because we're doing a little rearrangement, shuffle, hustle and shuffle. A little hustle and shuffle. We've been on Marketplace like a wild buffoon. Yeah, I've been looking for cars, you've been looking for couches. That's right, and we got one. Same, same, but different. <laughs> and then we're gonna uh, go hit up Turts. I haven't hit up Turts in when, April? Yeah, literally. It's been seven, eight months. Give or take. Crazy. So, we used to go once a week. Yeah. Twice a week. Twice uh, a week. And then uh, we got invited to Jay's work Christmas party. So you know what? Do her all, right? Do her all. And you we know don't what that have, means? We don't have time, but we're going to make it happen. We always make it happen. Because we're always rushing. This is what we do. Let's do it. We got a little convoy. We got our couch. We got Laura and our little convoy. <laughs> <laughs> Got the train horn. <laughs> oh, couple more stragglers. <laughs> That is awesome. <laughs> We're now the couch people. We've been pulled over twice and they've honked at us. <laughs> First time was to check straps. Second time was to, uh, I got that video. Now we're gonna pass them again. <laughs> <laughs> I feel, oh, they're not exiting here. We were worried they were gonna exit here, so we pulled over and got a video. Mark, you got this machine back. Yes, and it's still super, super clean, so. Um, yeah, I got it a couple months ago now, and then we waited for the stuff from Super ATV, and then the ECD wrap came in, so we wanted to keep it clean for the wedding, and we did. It was very, it was very tough, but we got her done. So first thing, right after the wedding, I got back from the honeymoon, I put the wrap on, so the stickers. And then about uh, two weeks after that, we had a, bit, a lot of rain, so I was waiting until it stopped raining and stuff. Make sure we don't lose the dog. Oh, come on. And then yes, the Super ATV parts started. So we'll start front to back, um, bumper, and uh, it's also it's a bumper and winch mount. So the winch is behind here, obviously, and it comes with hooks, which is nice. This is a bit different of a bumper than last time. Last time it was like this, but it went around here too. Um, and then we have rock lights. So the first one's actually up underneath here. It has to be running in that night for to see them. And then we turn the suspension around so. These reservoirs are usually on the inside. Now they're on the outside because it looks cooler, but it's a little tricky because these are smart shocks. So there's electronics built in. So let's see, there's a wire here that's attached to that. So, but uh, no, it went on pretty easy. And then there's a horn right here because we're going to make it street legal. So we, uh, last time this horn was under here. Now it's right here and it's a lot louder. Um, this looks like a rack of LED lights here, Mark. Yeah, yeah. So last time I had a curved RGB, so um, red, green, blue, so I could change colors. This one is just white, and it's got the focus lights in the middle, so it's got a really bright one in the middle, and then kind of floodlights on the side. These are popular in Australia. Been in yeah. Expeditions in the yeah. outback in Australia, and everybody has Everyone's them. Everyone's got them, yeah. Well, yeah, when you're out in the open, and you know. But uh, for the trails, it works really good as well. And I find in the summer, if there's a lot of bugs, I'll turn my headlights off and I'll turn these on and the bugs go over. If they, if you have your headlights on, they come straight at you. But if you have this on, they seem to go over. But I have a windshield now. Then we have the, the inner fender guards. Um, basically 32 tires rub a little bit if you jump and turn. So these are aluminum guards for the inside now. Uh, then we'll come back. We got the, the fold up windshield. Last time I just had a glass windshield, but it was really hot. So if we were driving around town, so this one actually flips up. Is this Pike's glass? Yep. So it just pops up like that, cool. which is nice. Um, our mirrors and then uh, Nerf, Nerf bars. So these are very handy because uh, sometimes you'll be, you know, rock crawling and then you'll fall off a rock or something and it'll, 
it'll just slam against the plastic. So these protect that quite a bit. Um, we put rock lights actually on the inside now. So they're under there. So at night, obviously you can see them. Uh, we have our back little mud flaps. These are protect from rocks flying off those tires and hitting, hitting the trailing arms. Uh, our whips. I had five foot whips last time. These are, I believe, three feet. And uh, they're tilted back a lot more, so you don't hit as many trees. Looks like there's lights in them. Yeah. Is that LED yeah, lights? full LED lights. Okay. So I will turn them on in a second for you. And then um, basically we just changed the back arms. So it comes with box front arms, but not on the back. So we put box rear arms and Rhino 2.0 axles. So there's a stronger beef here. Uh, we got the hitch mount, so you can tow a little license plate, a uh, little mount there. So I think that is about it. Mark, I see a stack of tires over here. Stack of tires. What's this all about? So we have we have three different sets of tires. We have the ones that come on it. They're 32 inch now. Um, I got, need to get some DOT tires so we can make it street legal, but these aren't too bad. Uh, we have these ones with the bullite rims, beadlock rims. They're studded. I just use bolts and uh, yeah, they don't leak and they work amazing on ice. Then we have the assassinators if you're if you really want to party and go through the deep mud. But you tend to break a lot of stuff. So and then we'll give you the lights here. Whoa, that's oh, that's bright. Sorry, that's the uh, <laughs> that's super bright. The the bar there. Then we have the rock lights and the whips. So these are the whips. As oh, you cool. can see. And we actually rigged them to work with the turn signals and brake lights. So, okay. okay, so that's the there's your left signal. Yeah, yeah. And there's your and right, there's signal. The right, cool. And then uh, we hit the brake. I believe they both go on. Yeah. Okay. So hit, hit the, the brake. brake. Yeah, yeah, there you go. And then you can kind of see inside too. We have lights in there. So, yeah, nothing too crazy. And we have a few more things we're going to do. We got to do an exhaust for it, and we got to do the stereo. That's the only other thing that's missing. Looks like you got LCD screen there. Yeah, display. yeah, they upgraded the screen the last couple of years, so it's a lot bigger. Um, oh, and we have a horn too. Wow. Very loud compared to the old one. So. That's what I need in my car. Yeah, and it comes with a belt temp gauge now built in. So last time it was aftermarket, now it's built in. And the harnesses are retractable, which is nice. So you can lean forward and turn around because before you couldn't. It was very hard to see. So they got padding on them as well. That's yeah. nice. So let's fire this thing up and. Go for, go for a ride. Well, it's mild today. Yeah, yeah, I'm hoping it's not too muddy down at Turtle Island, so. Oh, and we have the lower doors as well, aluminum doors, so. Unfortunately, when I ordered the wrap, I didn't know I had aluminum doors. I thought I had the plastic ones, so the wrap is actually made for the plastic doors, which only go to here, but whatever, it's fine. We'll probably fill it in later, but as soon as it gets muddy, you wouldn't even notice. Is this roof different, Mark? Nope. This is, uh, this is the roof that comes with okay. it. Okay. Yeah. And then uh, the XRS also comes with a skid plate as well. Wow. So. All Excellent. Right. We'll see you later. Nala, you're going to be permanently leased when you come to the farm now. Look at look here. On for two seconds. Not cool. It's your dog. It's your dog. It's your dog. <laughs> All right, well, we'll go wash her at Turtle. This thing is the cleanest you're going to see it the last time. Man, this thing looks good. Oh, let's do it. You ready, Dingus? You ready for the lap dog? No. Nope. <laughs> oh, no. What are we gonna do with you? Okay. Up, 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 up. Watch your tail. Let's roll.
she is clumpy mud down here. I took her pretty slow because, well, you know, I didn't want to get too, too muddy. But also, I realized we have a super ATV roof bag too. So obviously not much, much mud ends up up here. So yeah, we got four zippers, tons of different storage here. So I'll definitely be throwing the phone up there for from now often. And yeah, usually we have the door bags. I do have some door bags from Kemi Moto coming. So we'll get those installed. And then I also have the back window and the side plastic windows. So you excited? Oh, yeah. It's been a while since we've been down here. Eight months or so. Just out for a rep, are you bud? <laughs> are you bud? A machine. First pretty mud, pretty. her first mud. That was pretty smooth. Smooth driving. Smooth driving. Well, those uh, smart shocks, I tell you, night and day. I love how they look when they're turned around. Way cooler. And it also has the loudest horn now. The old horn wasn't that loud. The new one? Oh, apparently it's got to be half on. Here we go. Here's the button right there. Produce. Produce. And no, it's gone. All right, carry on. We got some company. Couple quarters. A couple of rippers. <laughs> the boys. Who's that now? Who's that? <laughs> Where Hold is some he? Some leftovers. Yeah. <laughs> Old Frank the Eagle. Screw it. Leave it. Too bad though. <laughs> Look at us just roughing it. And all I have the zoomies. Everyone left. Oh, dog, how you doing? Oh, so good. The best place on earth. First time in what, eight, nine months we've been down here? Yeah, it's wild. We were here so often before, so. This so is good. actually where I brought the old dog on her first date. Very first date. Very first. We're married. Our weekend date. Yeah, look at that. We're married now. Wild. <laughs> Crushed it. Crushed Boom. it. Boom. So, and this is the first trip on the new Maverick down here. And uh, first, for, I guess first mud for it too. So we're going to keep it kind of clean because we have a tight schedule and I don't have time to pressure wash it. So, but when in doubt, you know, just eat some dirt. Just eat some dirt. No, could you not? <laughs> uh, <laughs> all right couple a little few more minutes and we'll uh, get out of here also if you're down here please do not run over the fire pit <laughs> like these tracks are that was not me <sighs> be respectful be respectful don't mud the windows like whoever did that clean up do what you gotta do and eat dirt if you really want to no <laughs> Don't eat dirt! Oh, wow. Carry on! No. This way. <laughs> Come on, shaky legs. Come on, jump up. Look at the mud. Might go pop down the river, give her a quick little rinse a room. Everything else stayed pretty clean though. I floored it on the way out just to knock the mud off the wheels because it just kind of flings everywhere. And I'm a bit on the windshield, but all good. All right, let's keep, uh, keep the day going here. Guess how many people are gonna be at the GD Christmas party? 30. 700. <laughs> the old GD Christmas party. Let's make it up there. Cheers. I'm not going to say anything, Joe. <laughs> Two plates deep here. <laughs> hey, oh. Thank you. <laughs> 
salad disappeared already. Our Uber has arrived. There's only what, 10 of us? Did we all get in there? <laughs> Everyone in. Is this a Kia? <laughs> oh my God. And it continues. Hello, Nala, how are you? As you can see, we found a 15 foot leash for her because she rolled in a lot of poop last time. We got Chris back again. Yep. It is Monday in our world. I know on YouTube world, I don't know what day it is, but we had an awesome weekend. We went down to Turtle. We went to Jay's work Christmas party. That was random. And now we're back at it. So we got Another this. Cleaning day. Yeah, we got this half done. We're gonna try and get this half done. If anyone wants a vending machine, I mean, we're just gonna throw it out. But if uh, yeah, someone wants it. Let me know, I put an ad up on the Kijiji. So we got some stuff there. We got our little target for target practice there. We'll try and get all this stuff out today. Destroy our washer. Hey, we should fire that thing up now so when it gets into the fast wow, cycle. Yeah, we'll, we'll, for it. yeah, we'll throw the battery in. I don't know how we're gonna get this out of here, but hopefully the Ford is uh, feeling powerful today. So yeah, and then we got lots of crap in here as well. It's gathered over the years, so. All right. It won't be a full full garage build, but we'll get the shop looking good though. Yeah, be better, better than it was before yeah. crawling over stuff. So, all right, let's get at her. Let's get her burning. Oh yeah. The old trim clad special. <laughs> yeah, get it hot, hot. Yeah, burn some of this wood. I think she's pretty rotten. I don't know if she's going to light, but we'll try. Hasn't found any poop yet. As long as you don't poop right there, Chris, she won't she roll on it. <laughs> foot radius, yeah. Right Our laundry machine, I don't know. She's kind of giving up. You shut it off? I don't know. I moved it. Maybe oh, the door. Okay. Might have to restart it again. Stupid. Give her a whirl. Do a drain and spin, see if that works. But yeah, it hasn't really spun since, so she might be a, might be a goner here. We'll keep on burning though. Since we're doing cleaning anyways, we might as well bring this over, give her a quick little washeroo. Yeah, well, definitely loving this new Super ATV fold-up window. Oh yeah. And the breeze that comes through here, much better. Need some fuel though, getting low. Shop is definitely getting cleaner. Just gotta drag that thing out. Spill something, whoops. Give her a quick rinse, and we'll get out of here. filming all weekend random stuff so hopefully we'll get some more cars this week and uh, definitely take this thing out some more and the river's high so maybe we'll do some more skipping see what we can do and also the steel saw blade wheels are done for this thing so I'll pick those up and nice. then we'll definitely have some nice. fun we'll test them in the mud and then obviously when it freezes again in a few weeks test around some ice and uh, some frozen mud so thank you guys again 
Thank you, Chris, for helping clean up the shop. And we'll get there. Be, we'll get there. Yeah, slowly but surely, a wild journey, but uh, need need a need a space this winter. So yeah, we're covered, exactly. Right? Hangout spot for yeah. the boys. So don't do anything I wouldn't do. Make sure you follow Chris on Instagram and Super ATV and all the sponsors. Check out the links below. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. I know I said that already. Goodbye. <laughs>